Okay, welcome back, all of my prosperous hearts. As promised, this is the first in a four-part series wherein I will provide this my synopsis of and my biggest takeaways for my time at Unleash the Power Within with the incredible Tony Robbins. The reason why I'm making it a four-part series is to ensure that I don't take up too much of your time, as I know you've got things to do. So, day one at UPW Dallas 2014. So one of the biggest reasons why people are unhappy, why people fail, is our psychology. As Zig Ziglar always said, we were born to win, but we were programmed to fail. And it's only getting worse. But I won't go into that right now. I could rant about that for a while. Anyway, again, I'm just going to gloss over some of this simply because it's something you could learn in psychology books, and a lot of what Tony did for us simply cannot be understood in anything other than one of his events. He took us through the three elements of practical psychology, which is the ability to decipher what's really going on in any situation, both with ourselves and those we care about. And in order to be effective with this, there are three questions you need to answer. Number one, what stops us from moving forward, taking action, and being our best? Number two, what controls and determines the quality of our lives? Why do we do what we do? What's our ultimate drive? Oh, sorry, that was number three. Why do we do what we do? What's our ultimate drive? So what I didn't realize is that I've actually known the answers to these questions for a really long time, especially in doing the things that I've already been doing. So it should be common sense for me. But amazingly enough, our brains are some of the most complex yet frustrating things in our anatomy. What stops people from moving forward? Can you guess? Fear. It's a natural thing everyone has, and if you tell me you don't fear anything, well, you'll lie about other things too. <laughs> fear. I've been taught it means several things. False evidence appearing real. Buck everything and run. Whatever acronym you want to put to it, and it is something that it can destroy our psychology and immobilize us from taking action. But the biggest secret to fear is not learning how to avoid it or remove it, because that's impossible, but simply learning how to use it instead of allowing it to conquer you. Which leads us to number two. The thing that controls and determines our quality of life? Emotion. Think about it. If you were to close your eyes and imagine yourself in any given situation, your brain would begin to cause your body to react. This would affect your physiology, which in turn would affect your emotions, which in turn would affect your physiology. It's a vicious cycle, really. So let me ask you a question. You know about that woo-woo positive thinking stuff, right? There's some logic to that. When you're in a good mood thinking of positive things and smiling, you're going to be happy. Your brain will be more open to things, more open to opportunities to help you succeed and all that jazz. But if you're in a negative state of mind, if your physiology is in that same state, your brain shuts out anything other than what you're already thinking and feeling. Again, there's so much more that Tony talked about that he had us go through. I can't even begin to scratch the surface. You just need to go and experience it for yourself. The third thing he talked about was why we do what we do, and that's based on the fact that everyone has six human needs. It's wired into our nervous system, and it's insane how we act when these needs aren't met. In order to save you some time, I'll provide you a link at the end of this video that you can click on and look at, straight from Tony. So, from those three things, I came to realize that just like billions of people all over the world, I'm off balance. <laughs> and throughout the weekend, it was really weird, but... A lot of things started to come together, and, and once I realized this and recognized what the two needs I had been valuing most weren't the ones that, weren't allow, that were allowing me to be fulfilled. So, after putting us through our paces, getting this information into our heads, we were taken through a few exercises for us to realize what was most important to us, as well as what we had been focusing on. It allowed us to understand the pain we had been going through by being off balance, and to imagine the future when we focused on the two needs that we needed to transform our lives. We talked about, psych excuse me, Tony talked about psychology, human needs, communication, and beliefs. So much was jam-packed in the first day alone. My synopsis really can't do it justice. You must get to one of Tony's events, any of them, but definitely at least one of the unleashed power withins. And as promised, below you will find a few links to, ha to what I've discussed in regards to Tony, his events, and his additional systems you can use to get to work in your own time. It's kind of like having a life coach on demand. But believe me, immersion will make the most change in a short amount of time. So click on any of the links below for more information, including the final link to check out more of what I'm working on and looking into. As always, please comment on if anything I have said has inspired you, or if there's anything you would like to know more about that I may be able to provide more information on. I would love to hear your thoughts, and if there's anything I can do to help you. 
from my prosperous heart to yours. I look forward to seeing you again in my next vlog. Mwah. Ciao, mi amici.